Okay, guys. Good morning. Welcome to the next way trading. My name is Lester. Um, today we have a few questions about uh, five minute strategy, and I'm gonna try to explain how we can identify a good thing and trying to follow or avoid it. This type of mistakes uh, we sometimes made it. Even the admin made in this type of mistakes sometimes. Um, okay. Uh, I, I, right now I follow the things of Harry and have a, this question. Well, in the moment they send the thing, we need to enter or not? Or we, how much time we need to enter? Five minutes, three minutes, one minute, whatever. Um, first of all, the rules, uh, are this, okay? We enter only if we mark the and moving average cross it. Simple, right? Simple. But I'm gonna give you these tips or this uh, few advice how to follow on when is the good moment to enter. For example, this thing. See? Um, in my opinion, I don't enter in these type of things. Or, or don't trade in these type of things. Why? Well, first of all, I think the, a good thing is put here. Okay. This one put, but this is cold because the moving average is going blue is going up and it's going to cross with the yellow, but the yellow is the, the yellow is above of the red moving average. So, with these things, it's so confusing, so I prefer not enter. And second, have this resistance here. See it? Touch and it's turned down, touch and it's turned down. <laughs> touch it, and again. So my recommendation is try to avoid these type of trades, okay? Um, definitely, you're gonna see this a lot, a lot in the market. What happened with this another thing? Okay, this is a few examples. What's a good scene or good moment to enter this? Why? It's not an uptrend, even a downtrend. When in, in the last, I don't know, 45 minutes, looks like a going up. And it start with this downtrend here. Okay. Uh, if you see it in, I don't know, we're going to see it in one hour. One hour. Looks like, uh, like up, but in the last two hours is going down so fast. Um, so with this, looks like a cold, uh, it's a good thing to call cross it because cross it the MACD, but never touch it the moving average. And what happened? Continue with the downtrend. So sometimes we send these type of things because it's possible crossing the, uh, the moving average and getting a good uh, up a quote uh, thing, but sometimes that don't happen. What do you have to do? Well, don't enter if you do moving average, never cross it, okay? Simple, but another advice I'm gonna give you again is remember, always try to see if you have a good resistance. If you have a good resistance and uh, crossing here, I don't know, I just waiting, I just waiting uh, to see what happened with that candle. And I'm gonna uh, tell you, what I doing in that type of case? Well, I waiting to see what happened within that candle. The moment they crossing the moving average, okay. The moment they crossing the moving average, and have that cold green and start down. I waiting a little bit to see the behavior of that candle, and if it start down, I enter only and the minutes the rest in that candle. Okay, this candle is for five minutes, and if you only have for I don't know. Three minutes, I enter for three minutes. That is my advice. Okay? That is something that I do. It's not a rule. 
but it's just my advice. So what happened with this? We need to see all the big picture. Definitely I enter in this one. It's a crazy behavior with the candles, but it's a downtrend. See, it's a downtrend. And uh, the scene is for a put. It's, it's so close. The red, uh, all the moving average. So that is risky too. Okay, that is risky too. But maybe you don't have time or whatever. I don't know. You need to trade. Uh, I recommend you see carefully with this in, because have these uh, candles. Look at this. All the candles have these crazy jumps. So what do you have to do? Waiting. Waiting a little bit and getting a better price to enter. Okay? That is my tips to get in a better results in your trading session with five minutes room. Um, I'm going to trade later with the five minutes and I'm going to provide you a few things. I'm trying to record that uh, session that I'm going to have Friday. Remember, I don't try Fridays because it's crazy market. It's a volatile market. Um, we can lose in money in this weekend. So I prefer don't trade Fridays. That is my advice too. It, I hope this video like it. I can, I hope this video can help you to get in a better enter on uh, the moment we provide you these things. Or if you trade along with the five minute strategy, I hope this video can help you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, activate the notification bell, and see you in the next video.